And to kind of round out, and we started off talking about politics, so let's end with some. A poll analyst is saying that conservatives will be doing well if they hang on to nord- uh, current northern seats, and hopefully they can pick up a couple of more. So you know pollsters, they're always kind of projecting what's going to happen in mm-hmm. the future. Are you are you a, a big believer in polls? Do you think that they're... I think they are an indication, but it depends okay. who's doing the polls, and a lot of times they are biased, so it depends. You'd have to know the question and who they're asking. But yeah, I think polls, if they're done properly... Can you be. know, I kind of, I, I was like you until very recently. And I learned a principle in finance okay. that changed my mind about polls. Okay. I don't and know. I don't know if I'll curious. be able to. We're curious. I don't know if I'll be able to uh, sufficiently explain it. In 30 seconds? In 30 seconds, but I'll try. There's a, this, uh, this type of financial transaction called a futures contract. Uh huh. And it's important right now because the world's kind of going crazy right now. I think Basically, so. like two people exchange a contract that says, I will buy this from you on this day at this price. So instead of doing it today, you do the deal in the future. That's kind of how I see polling now. It's not a deal today. No. Like when you say, oh, I'll vote for the conservative guy, and it's like a year out from the election, you're not making a future contract. No. Until you sign on the paper, it's not done. So to me, polls are kind of like, it's a good finger on the pulse of, you know, what they're thinking today. For sure. But it has nothing to do with what the election will be like. No, and that's, we've seen that before. We've seen elections say, oh, so-and-so is going to slam dunk uh, win and blah, blah, blah. And then everyone's surprised after, how did that happen? You know? So again, polls aren't always a science. Absolutely. Absolutely.